After nine days of us doing this, I knew that by the time we got home from our vacation, the garden was going to be pretty out of control. So let's go ahead and take a look and see just how bad it got. Things are lush and overgrown. Look at this jungle. This is not the jungle, this is the garden. It's a garden, yeah. Mama. It is a garden. The grass is really tall. Poor mom patch is turning into something. Oh, this garden. It's really overgrown. Sunflowers. I want to get tomatoes. Laying on the ground. The sunflowers. Wow. Tomatoes. Beautiful sunflowers coming in though. These giant sunflowers. There's a bunch of tomatoes here that I need to pick. You have the basket? Look at those beauties. Come here. Gorgeous tomatoes. Okay, let's put them in the basket. Where's the tomato? Well, I'm gonna get some more. There's some more. Oh, we still have critters. Caterpillars up there. Mama. Yeah, lots of caterpillars, but you know what? I'd rather them be eating these sunflowers than my peppers and tomatoes. Okay, come here. I got too many tomatoes. I got too many tomatoes. Mm. Yeah. Garden's getting crazy. I'm going to myself with these beans. Oh, Uh-oh. Here, Eli, put that in the basket. Put this in the basket? Mm-hmm. Oh, my gosh, this thing is giant. Don't put it in here, okay? Mm. Don't put it in there. Yeah, we'll put that one in this other basket over here. Ooh, look at these pretty sunflowers. All these flowers over here. Look at that. Giant sunflower. I don't know what this is. I'm going to pull it out. Okay, look at all these tomatoes we got. Come here. Okay. Oops. I heard one fall. Can you see it down there? Look, it's right there. See it right there? Thank you. Okay. Man, Eli, look at all these red tomatoes over here, too. Oh, pretty tomatoes. I'm going to get a green tomato. No, we don't pick the green ones. Look, we're going to go around and get those other ones. Gosh, this garden. Looks like there's a bunch of rotten tomatoes over here. I'm gonna go around and get those off. And this squash, oh my gosh. Oh, look at the squash. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Here, let's go put these on in that other basket. Here, you like, oh, look, I've got some honeydew melon. Here, put that in that other basket. In the big basket? 
Yeah. Wow, look, I've got some honeydew melons growing. Another one up here. Another one up there. Wow, I've never grown honeydew melon. That's exciting. Oh, the okra. Oh, here, I'll put that in the other basket. Wow, this lemon balm is sure looking happy. Oh, this lemon balm. There's a bunch of stuff growing in here. Okay, so here's the other side of the tomato bush that I just picked. And, you know, I don't know about these beans. I didn't really get to harvest a lot off of these beans. And, I don't know. I need to figure out how to harvest this echinacea and use it. Look, here's another pickle. Here, put that pickle in there, Eli. Hey, careful with those scissors. Don't hold those like that. Tomatoes. I really don't know what I'm doing here with this eggplant. I'm just kind of pruning it here and there. Okay, this pepper plant is pretty bent over, but got a few good peppers on it. Whoops, I ripped it. Okay, work that, but be able to use those. Here, put these pepper plants in there. Cookies, squash just got really giant and probably too big to they, eat. They, That's they, just too they big. Squash, they have to squash. But there's a few new ones that are here that we can take. I'm gonna make some zucchini, or actually some yellow squash and tomato pasta. It's one of my favorite summer dishes. So we'll make that with these tomatoes and this squash that I'm picking. I've got to get these other tomatoes. There's some pretty good rotten ones. I don't know. That looks pretty bad. Uh-oh, look Eli, we gotta trim this basil. It's going to flower. Here Eli, grab this basil. Oh, this pasta. Cut all this stuff off that's going to flower. Hold on Eli, mama's gotta cut all this off. Here, put, take this piece that's gonna fall off. Grab that piece. Yeah. This is what the garden looks like after a week of oh, neglect. Mama, the so I got my work cut out for me, but we'll get to it. Some mowing and cleaning up. So here's how the garden is looking the next day after a couple of hours of mowing and weed eating and a lot of heavy pruning. Um, I came through and composted some of the honeydew melons, the tomatoes, the eggplant. Uh, just grabbed some of the compost out of the composter ball and just placed it there at the base of the plants. So hopefully that'll give them an extra boost to grow a little bit more. But as you can see, there is a lot more room for these um, honeydew melons and other plants to breathe. Um, I went and I pulled out quite a bit. And here's a pretty big pile of everything that I pruned away, mostly squash trimmings and a lot of tomato trimmings too.
Yeah. You got green tomato? That red one looks good. We should wait to pick the green ones until they turn red. Let's go put them in the basket. Yeah, let's go put them in the basket. Let's, let's go. Put them in the basket. Over here. There's all of our stuff that we collected. So I have a basket full of echinacea. And some passion flower vines that I am going to look how pretty these are. Make some tea. I trimmed back the archway because it was hanging over quite a bit. So got that trimmed down. And got these two giant melons. I'm gonna hold it. That's pretty big. Pretty good sized honeydew melon. Got two of those and some lemon balm, tomatoes, and some jalapenos. Are you gonna eat that honeydew melon? Let's eat it. Let's eat it. Sounds like a good idea. Let's eat it. 